Yes, sir, DJ Karis up for So, I'm saying DJ Karis. Yes, but, uh, I'm sure the guys who are watching at home. And I said, hey, I'm the only DJ Karis. I'm going to talk about it. Tell us just briefly a little bit about of, of your story. Just briefly, yes. Uh, my story is... Uh, hey, lakini mko sawa? Wazi, wazi. Sema, yeah! Sijawa iskia, yeah! Yeah! Kitu kama yo, madem, yeah! Yeah! Kitu kama yo. Yeah! So you, so you started DJing when, first of all, tell us. Uh, okay, I started DJing uh, immediately after high school. Mm -hmm. That was uh, a few years back. <laughs> okay, a few years back. Yes. What is the tarehe? Um, Mwaka. Not to say my year. Don't faint, guys. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, I started playing commercially mm -hmm. when I was getting paid. That is mm -hmm. when I started earning in 1989. Yeah. Yes, sir. So... Apo pigeni makofi tafadhali pigeni makofi. Yeah. Your yes. time watu walikuwa idea hapa hapa. Uh, I guess most of you are still ideas. Idea idea. Napanga kukuana. <laughs> yes, uh, but, but you know from then until now you still play, you still get paid. I uh, just met your son. <laughs> yes. Uh and so, what has kept you, you know, I mean music has changed, right? But you're still relevant, you're still out there still making the money. Okay, uh, it's quite simple, Willis. You see, like, these artists who are performing here, mm -hmm. some of them come from way back, you know. Right, right. Because I used to play for them when they were starting mm -hmm. in the jam session afternoon discos mm -hmm. back in a club that used to be called F1 and F2. Mm -hmm. Akina Red Sun, Akina Waire, they all started there when, when in their high school days. Mm -hmm. So they used to come and, you know, in the rap competitions, Akina Jua Kalinan. So um, for me, keeping it where... It is right now, okay. It's because I compete with myself. Mm. I don't compete with anyone. Mm. Uh, I do my thing. Uh, I am very disciplined. Mm. As you know, uh, most DJs, uh, most people think DJs is uh, our core job. Mm -hmm. I can tell you right now on live TV that DJing is now a profession. Right. It's a career. Right. And you can make money with DJing. So long as you put these three things in your mind, mm -hmm. one, Stay focused, mm -hmm. two, discipline, and three, be your own competitor. Right. Usiseme ati unataka kucheza kama DJ A ama DJ B. We cheza kama DJ Kariz ama DJ Willis. Yes, DJ yeah. Willis. Blue, 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 blue. Skip it, pop, pop. All right, Uta Asni. Uh, <laughs> so, like, so if guys want to catch you, like, where do you play nowadays? If they want to follow you, follow uh, your, your music where you play your trade, where can they find you? Okay, uh, first and foremost, I am a freelance DJ. I okay. don't have a permanent uh, a permanent a place that I play every yes. day. Yes. Because once you get permanent, you get locked. But sometimes I do contracts here and there with uh, various establishments. Uh, but right now I'm not engaged in any because this is a peak season for business. Right. So getting engaged in some of these things, you lock yourself up. Right. However, you can find me, uh, you can download my old school mixes at the mixcloud.com uh, at DJ Kariz. My Twitter handle, Twitter. Twitter, on Twitter. Twitter, on Twitter. <laughs> yes. My Twitter handle is uh, at DJ Kariz. D E E J A Y K A R E E Z. E E Z. E E Z. All Not right. Kariz. See Kariz. Kariz. At the Yapana. Kariz. Kariz. With a swag. All right, with a swag. Mm, All right. Yes. Asante Sana, DJ Kariz is going to be still chilling with us a little bit. And then we want to go now back to uh, talk to these guys when they when they came through when the show started uh, they set the stage on fire so we want to just uh, talk to them right about 